Hello, this is my educational video on how to make pour over coffee. This is all the things you'll need. I know that you don't have a scale, so I'm gonna tell you the conversion of like grams to cups as we go. So, what you want, oh gosh, he's meowing. What you want is about 22 grams of whole coffee bean. And we figured out that's basically the same as one third of a cup. We grind it up and then we put it in the pour over, pour water over it until you have a final product that's about 17 times as much weight as coffee. So for grams, that's gonna be around 330 grams of water. And if you convert that to cups, it's like one and a half cups. And I'll keep, I'll say all this as we keep going. So grinding the coffee beans. You guys have this nice blade grinder as well. Oh, where's the top? Here it is. You want to get it, I'll show you what it looks like after, afterwards. All right. Yeah. All right. Something I like to do is to pre-wet the filter and also this warms up the glass. What's it being so meow about? All right. So we have the coffee inside the filter and the next part, you do need to time out your steps. So sometimes I put the little timer on my phone. All right, to walk through the steps, we're first going to do a small amount of water just above where the bed of coffee stops for about 30 seconds. Then we put on about double that amount of water for another minute. And then we slowly pour continuously until you have the entire coffee cup filled. And that's gonna last hopefully a little over three minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and start. I'm gonna start with the first pour. And the way you do this is directly in the center and just light circles around. And I'm gonna do just, just that much, just for like a little pre-infusion. You can see the uh, bubbling right there, that's from CO2 releasing. It shows that you have freshly ground beans. All right. It's been about 30 seconds, so I'm gonna double it up to maybe a little over 100 grams total of water. Okay. And we'll let that run for another 30 seconds. Okay. And now it's a step where you're going to slowly pour. You're gonna do concentric circles going out to the edge, but not all the way to the edge. And then once you get the level water just above the bed of coffee grinds, then you're going to pour water such that the outflow is equal to the inflow of water. So the level of water is not gonna change. You're gonna be using one and a half cups total. That's kind of equivalent to like 340 grams of water, I think. I'm just gonna let it um, drain through. And that's pretty much it. Yep. Bing.